now for the Breeders' Cup Marathon. Field has sent on the mile and three-quarter journey. They all came out well. Father time, low early speed has dropped back second last. The early leader, as expected, is Black Aster now, and he's taking them along with his ears pricked. He's going a good pace for this distance. He opens up almost three lengths of him. It's Nightlight in the gold colors, going to take the second spot. On the far side is Sir Dave in the red cap. Down at the rail is Muhanak, last year's winner, just a comfortable fourth in the early stages. Alongside of that, we have Mastery. He's in the blue colors, back in the fifth spot. He's now five off that leader, and Father's time has quickened. Now he's moved up between horses. On the outside is Al Dafar in the white cap, who's now seven off these leaders. Then we come back to Cloudy's Knight, who's taken back towards the rear. Gangbuster is content to sit back second last, and Man of Iron is the trailer. Ten lengths would cover them all. Coming to the top of the stretch now, first time round, and Black Aster got it all his own way. Nice, easy lead. Got those ears kicked forward, and he's just loping them along in no hurry whatsoever. Black Aster in front, just over a length. Now it's Nightlight right there in second. Along the inside, we have Muhannock, also just on an easy range, has been allowed to lope along. Here's Frankie Dottori on Mastery in the blue colors. He's sitting fourth now, four and a half off the leaders, and Father Time is right up alongside of him. Sir Dave is on the outside. Side. Then we come back to Cloudy's Knight, who's giving them six-length start. Coming back towards the back markers here, we have Al Darfer, who's now dropped to right back to second last, been passed by Man of Iron, and Gangbuster is the trailer. He gives them 11-length start. Just over half the journey covered now, and it's still Black Aster in front here by just under two. Been tracked throughout by Nightlight in second, and a very patient ride by Muhannock down at the rail, just sitting dead still, two and a half off these leaders. Father Time is on the far side. Now Frankie to tarry on Mastery. Now he's going to have to get out of there. Right now he's blocked in behind horses. Long way to go, but he is still sitting in behind there. He just took a peep over his shoulder. Now I'm pretty sure Frankie to tarry is going to hook out rather than get stuck down there. On the outside, here comes Cloudy's Knight now to put the pressure on. Now they starting to quicken. Behind that comes Man of Iron gangbuster. Al Defar did not go on with it and Sir Dave has dropped out. They come into the 3 8 pole now and here's Cloudy's Knight the nine year old and Cloudy's Knight is the new leader and kicking on for home now. But now Mastery's hooked out and here comes Mastery with a shooting speed on the outside and they have been tracked now. Man of Iron on the outside chasing them from third. Father Time did not go on. Top of the lane now in the marathon and Cloudy's Knight digs deep finds more. Mastery on the outside is taking him on, coming on the run on the inside. Man of Iron, these three are full well clear of the rest. They are coming inside the eighth ball now. Along the inside, it's Man of Iron. Cloudy's Knight, Man of Iron going to outrun him. They running down to the wire. Extremely close. It looked like Man of Iron, but it's only a nose. Cloudy's Knight is right there. Mastery finished up third and Gangbuster a distant fourth.